Hola muchachos, nosotros vamos a hacer una bala de español para averiguar lo que estoy diciendo. Sigue el video. Hablo inglés también. All right, we're going to switch over to English now. What I said is we're going to try, or we're going to tie, the Spanish bullet fly. Spanish bullet is just basically a Paragon style fly with mostly thread. And this is in the French coloration, which is just black and red. This is just a Paragon pattern. It's a fulling mill fly called the Spanish bullet. Um, and it's tied in, um, what you might call it, just black and red. Very simple fly. So I've got a size 16 hook in the vise with a three millimeter bead. I believe you can tie them in a lot of different things, but the first thing that I'm going to do is just secure the bead with some thread and tie in a tail just with a few fibers of some Coq de Leon. All right, the way I like to tie in my Coq de Leon is I like to kind of angle this upward on the near side of the hook to me to, to get the length that I want and then just pinch it in place. And my first wrap of thread will push that right onto the top of the body. So that's a little bit short for what I want. So I'm just going to take off some of the tension, pull it back until I get the, the length that I'm looking for. That looks a little better. So from here, I'm going to unwind my thread or spin it counterclockwise so that I can flatten it out and just take my thread down to the end of the body. Um, for the for the red spot on this, you can use any red flash that you want. Um, so I've got a little bit of red flash. I'm tying that in right here. I'm, I'm just using minimal wraps because I want to keep this body pretty slim. And then this the flash tends to slip around a little bit. So where I'm going to wrap over the thread, I'm going to dab it with a little bit of super glue so that it stays right where I put it. There we go. So that's all the, the red we're going to put in there. You can see it's a pretty subtle red. And then I'll trim off my my Coq de Leon and my, my tag, and I'm just going to cover that up with thread now. So from here, I'm just going to build a little bit of a taper. Right up to there, and whip finish it. So I'm going to spin my thread clockwise when I whip finish it because I've found that if it's too flat it will try to jump back down the hook. And I just use a few turns of whip finish to keep it really small. So from here you can see it's a, it's a pretty bumpy body actually. So we're going to take some resin and tag it with some resin and smooth that out. All right. So once I have it smoothed out to a certain degree, just hit it with the light. And that's all there is to it. It's a super simple fly to tie. It gets down fast and it fishes really well.